Okay, good morning everybody. It is Tuesday after daylight savings time and I'm tired. This uh, loss of an hour of sleep is rough. But today, the big day. So first off, we're filming a commercial. I'm filming a commercial with Bright Futures. And if you live in the state of Florida, you know what Bright Futures is. We have a Florida lottery system here and the Florida lottery basically funds Bright Futures scholarships. And a long, long time ago, I was a recipient of a Bright Futures scholarship and so because of my teacher of the year stuff, and I'll talk more about that later, um, basically they've chosen me to film this commercial and be uh, a voice for Bright Futures and just show what it means for kids to have scholarships, to go to school and to help with expenses and that type of stuff. Oh, that's really bright. Anyway, um, so I'm excited about doing the commercial. That's gonna be really cool. And then tonight, my stuff should be in from Amazon, so we should be able to uh, basically build out my studio and show you the lighting and just kind of get um, get everything going um, for AP Growth 101. And that's something I'm excited about. I'll throw an intro in here in a little while of AP Growth 101 into this and talk about the idea of helping kids in AP classes and helping all students across the board. And Anyway, so it'll be a lot of fun. Now, I've never been in a commercial before. I'm not exactly sure what to expect, but I'm excited. I'm excited to talk about kids going to school. I'm excited to talk about scholarship opportunities. We have so many scholarships that are available to kids now, and it's such a great thing to promote higher education, um, to promote, and even if you want to go learn a skill or a trade, um, Bright Futures in the state of Florida is pretty specific to college, but it's just great for kids to go on and, and be able to invest in their future. And I think that's one of the most important things. It's one of the most important things for our country, for us individually, um, and for the growth overall of everybody is to continue college education and to allow kids to have that opportunity to go and not be completely and totally covered up in debt when they come out. Um, that's really the goal. If they're covered up in debt, it really makes it very hard to prosper as they go forward as young adults. Okay, hey, hey everybody. We are, um, we're just out here kind of rolling and, and shooting this commercial to continue to push Bright Futures um, and scholarships. It's been a lot of fun. It's a great experience. I'm gonna give you a little shot of the crew. Um, so we got some pretty high tech stuff going on. What's up? Everybody saying hi, got a hey. boom mic. It's good stuff. Um, and so why don't you tell them like, what is the purpose of this filming? What, what's the benefit of this? Yeah, sure. Hey, first of all, <laughs> Greg is an amazing actor. Oh, well, yeah. Yeah, in looks. And uh, so we're out here filming today for the Florida Lottery, just letting everyone know the amazing things that uh, the, the Bright Futures uh, Scholarship is able to do for the uh, citizens of Florida. Uh, not only students uh, that are start currently in school, uh, high school students who are gonna right. earn those things, but also Greg here who uh, used that to go back to school and get this amazing degree in education. Yeah, that's great. And so it's a lot of fun, um, and I've had a great time shooting with these guys and learning about filmmaking. It's been, a, it's been a good day, it's been a good day. So we'll check back in in a little while, and uh, thanks a lot. All right, everybody, that's a wrap on a super busy day. I had a great time filming the commercial. Uh, I learned a lot about just cinematography and the way that audio and video come together. So those guys were really cool to work with, and uh, I really enjoyed it. It should be coming out about the end of March. I will definitely share it on social media as we try to promote the idea of scholarship and the idea of Bright Futures in the state of Florida. Hobby Lobby. Okay. What do you need at Hobby Lobby? Well, we're gonna run by Hobby Lobby. Just got home, took the dog out. We're gonna go by Hobby Lobby real quick to. Uh -oh. um, we eat first. Okay, we're gonna eat first. Then we're gonna go to Barberitos. Then we're gonna go by Hobby Lobby. Mommy's at work. Sissy's got dance. And then um, try to find some stuff for my studio. We're gonna try to get the studio built out tonight. Excited for that. And uh, talk about AP Growth 101 and show you an intro. So good stuff. Okay, so we're in Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby's like a store full of stuff. It's very nerve-wracking if you're a rather large individual such as myself. I always feel like I'm gonna knock everything off the shelves. And anyway, so I just figured I'd come in and kind of peruse Wendy, around. Customer service, please. Wendy, customer service. Wendy, um, just find a couple decoration stuff, just kind of outfit my studio. Something that looks educational. Okay, not finding much yet. A lot of stuff for man caves. But I don't know if they have an educational vlog section. 
So after much deliberation, I feel that one of these globes will be a nice addition to our studio. So I'm happy with that. That's good. Okay, so we're going upstairs in my house. <clears throat> this is basically where I've got this bonus room and where I'm essentially building my studio. Now, um, the goal is to improve the lighting. So I have bought some lighting. Um, Lamo Studio from Amazon has got these soft box lights. I'll show you those in a minute. And then I got some lighting from Target to soften things up and it's directional, just a very simple directional floor lamp. A desk, some very basic decorations, but the most important thing is my whiteboard. It's actually a glass board that I'm gonna to try to get set up today. So to set up a studio, you don't need a big space. Um, just kind of come over here so you can see. I'm gonna kind of open this up here and, uh, and this is where I'm gonna try and do the majority of my shooting for my educational videos and the stuff about AP. Like I say, trying to get the lighting right is the biggest issue. That is what I'm working on now. And then um, get that mounted and we'll be ready to go. No matter how busy we get, we always make time for reading. When you get to school, he'll put his things in your locker. Locker and take all a, a look. Around. Good. Good job. Okay, studio build out is pretty much done. Um, got my desk together, got my lighting, and I've got actually this the lighting set came with two of these. Um, it was very reasonable, so I actually may wind up adding more depending on whether or not I want the softer light or this more like fluorescent light. Um, but I'm really happy with it. Let's take a seat and see what we got. Looks nice. Looks really good. So we'll be able to teach right here. We'll be able to talk about things. Um, obviously, we'll have to make some adjustments, but uh, I'm good. I'm good. I'm really happy with this. And my glass board here can be used for multiple things. Uh, obviously, I have to adjust some reflections and things like that. But I'm excited about this glass board and being able to, uh, to just show some different ideas on it. So I can definitely use the whiteboard for good advertising. You can show some really awesome graphs. You can also use this board to highlight pieces of AP Human Geography such as Central Place Theory, discussing city growth, size, and complexity. So basically that's the introduction to my studio. I've definitely got some work to do, um, some tweaking, and obviously got to work on lighting and get the lighting right. Uh, but so far so good. I like it. I'm going to keep working on it, make sure I get it right before we, uh, before we film any videos. And so uh, I'm going to close out today with a quick intro, see what you think. Well, what did you think of the intro? Hope you liked it. We've got a lot of work to do. We've got a lot, cover a lot of classes. Uh, click down below, like, and subscribe to these videos. Um, we are going to be uploading pretty much daily as we begin to dive into all the different subject areas. Look forward to it. Thanks for watching. Catch you guys next time.